Yo, what's up, YouTube? I'm your boy, Double A, Matt Skills, and this is the Rotor for Champions RTG Edition, and I'm pumped, man, because today is the reward edition, baby. We got some rewards in our face, and I believe we got Elite 1, uh, so that's going to be absolutely fun to open up our Elite 1 rewards and see what we get. Now, Booyah Nation, we have 17,000 coins. This is what the deal is, all right? I'm, I'm going to open up these packs, and depending on the coins we make, we possibly could do one of the blue ones. Uh, one of the blue, um, the, 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 I believe the, whatchamacallit, I keep, I keep forgetting what it's called, wait, oh, also, I'm selling Courtois, he was so bad for us, I didn't play with him the last 10 games of Foot Champions last weekend, so we're gonna place him on the transfer list, we're gonna sell him, he was just bad, I, I, I don't know, I'm gonna use Butlin instead, or maybe even get the Haya back, and I know I said Courtois was one of the best, and he got me 38-2, and two, but for some reason last weekend, he was so bad, but anyways, I have Talishka somewhere in here, Talishka's in here, I'm pretty sure we got Talishka, he, maybe he's up on the we have him somewhere so have a Talishka on this account so depending on the coins we make we are going to complete a walkout what you call it team at a knockout stage um uh, uh squad builder and try to see if we can get a walkout blue card all right that's what we're going to do depending on the rewards also as we look at the team let me just tell you what i'm thinking i'm thinking about getting rid of casemiro now we need a madrid player which means if we make enough coins we're going to probably buy Modric um to link up with cristiano ronaldo but casemiro just didn't get the job done for me so when we open up the blue card we're going to pray that casemiro walks out and we have a blue casemiro that's like an 86 87 maybe 88 rated card then it'll be stellar man so we got a lot of things we could do with this team this team obviously didn't do as good as we've done which was 38 and 2 before with the all bpl team but it did get us at least elite one so that's good enough now team of the week looks good because it's anthony martial supposedly messi can't come out of these packs which is absolutely dumb there's also christian benteke who could help us um as i look forward i don't really see ter stegen can't really help us as we have a bpl defense maybe he could help us we'll figure that out here very shortly um but there is Anthony Martial. So hopefully we can make some money. If not, hit Anthony Martial. We got two packs. Let's jump into it. Enough of the talk. And you guys know the strategy. You guys know what I'm going for. I'm also going to play some D1 games in this episode. So we have a lot going on. First of all, let's open up our rewards. And then we're going to fix our team and play some games. Elite 1, as I said. Not bad. Road to Glory has hit an Elite 1, I believe, like four or five times now. We've gotten top 100 one time. So we have some good stuff, man. Now, I could save these two rare jumbo packs. I could save them, I could save them for team of the season. So that's a massive possibility, Booyah Nation. I could legitimately save those. Right now we have 142K, which means we can get our boy, um, what's his face? We can get, um, uh, uh, we can get uh, De Gea already. We can get Modric already. But could we possibly play Ronaldo on seven chemistry, okay, and get a legend? That might, be a, that might be a possibility. Now, we have two jumbo packs. I'm not sure what I want to do. I'm not sure if I want to open these up yet or save them for team of the season. I'm really thinking about saving them for team of the season. First thing I'm going to do is open up a guaranteed team of the week. Okay? We usually open up these first, but today I'm going to open up these first. I'm going to open up a, a, a team of the week one because, like I said, if we hit what we need, I'm saving those jumbo packs. If we don't hit what we need and we need coins, we're opening up those jumbo packs. All right? Everything is recording. Booyah Nation. If you still love this series, can we get 20,000 likes? It's been a while since we got 20,000 likes on this channel. It's been like five, five days. That's a long time for this channel. Y'all always go ham. Can we get 20,000 likes? Let's do it. Now, with that being said, here we go. Guaranteed. Not even a walkout. Okay, that's no big deal. Martial's not a walkout either way. Let me see striker. Let me see striker. Oh, it's Ter Stegen. That's not bad. That's not bad. I'm going to say that's not bad. Y'all are probably saying skills. That's bad. That's not bad. In my opinion, not bad. What's Martial? Oh, the rest is bad. Oh, gosh. Uh, Ter Stegen must sell for 28. Ooh. That's bad. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's bad, bruh. All right. Could have been worse. Hey, legit. Could have been worse. Could have been worse. My, what's Martial's rating? Let me check Martial's rating really, really quick. I think he's like an 87, right? Where's Martial at? 86 or 87? What is his rating? 86. Okay, he's an 86. That's a high possibility of us getting him, yo. That's a massive possibility. Should we open these jumbos or not? Save him for team of the season or open them? Oh, what is it? Uh, top rated players. Dude, do we save? Let's open up the next team of the week. Here we go. Team of the week guaranteed. Let's open up this one, right? Or do we open up one jumbo? The rare player packs never pay out either way. Should we even say, you know what? I'm not saving them. I'm not saving them. I made my decision. I'm not saving them. We need coins right now. Probably should have saved them. I didn't save them. They never pay out either way. 
probably really should have saved those for team of the season. A lot of people in the comments are probably going to say, Scale, you should have saved those. But all these players will give us coins. Not only that, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm going to save these. Why? Because this is how I'm going to complete the team of the, the blue thing. The team of the, the squad, the, the uh, team of the knockout stage, whatever it's called. That's exactly how we're going to complete it with these players right here from the jumbo pack. So one more jumbo pack real quick. Not a walkout, no nothing. Not even a big flare. We'll keep all these players to complete the team of the year knockout stage. Or not team of the year. Team of the knockout, team of the knockout stage uh, squad builder challenge. And hopefully get a good walkout Casemiro and change this team completely. Three 83 ready players. A lot of 83 ready players. That's really going to help us be able to finish this team, that, that uh, squad builder challenge off, right? So with that being said, let's go ahead and open up this last uh, uh, elite uh, team of the week thing. And hopefully um, get something that can help us. Either make us some coins or get us Martial. Please, man. Please, Martial. Please, Martial. I never asked you for too much, EA. Okay, yep. Oh, man. Gonzo with his 37 pace, bro. Oh, Gonzo with... Oh, and the same two guys again. Man, we worked so hard for that elite, man. We worked so hard for that elite. We worked so hard for that elite. Ah, okay, we're gonna keep them because like I said, we can easily compete complete squad builders now. You can see my mood was all the way at the bottom. This is FIFA, man. And FIFA could take you from the happiest person to the saddest person to the happiest person in just seconds. And what you're about to see is me go from that guy really sad about my elite rewards into a guy that is ex extremely happy. And it's crazy, right? Because those elite wards, uh, rewards didn't pay out, okay? 28,000 coins for Terstegen. Come on, that's a, that's a bomb. But what it did was give me a bunch of gold players that I turned around and turned them into a squad builder challenge. I thought I had Talishka, but I actually turned Talishka in to get Aubameyang. So I had to pay 11,000 coins for that blue cam you're seeing right there off the market. It was, a, it was one of those knock, team of the knockout stage cards. And what you're watching me do right now is complete the team of the knockout stage uh, tradable one. I'm completing them all. I did all four of them. I'm completing it to see if I can get a good team of this knockout stage blue card either one that could fit our team or one that i can sell now booyah nation it's all about us on this series creating our luck like for me you don't want i know you guys don't click this series to watch a, a pro trader you don't click this series to watch someone beast and feast making coins you click this series because you know that i'm gonna do oh, maybe possibly okay in the in the weekend league and make some coins and that's how we're gonna build our teams is by creating our lone luck by trying to perform in the weekend league and no different here Nothing's different. The only difference is we got extremely lucky with the non-tradable Obamiang about two or three episodes ago. If you guys remember, if you don't remember, go check it out because we pulled the team of the year. Team of the, I keep saying that, team of the knockout stage blue card, uh, Obamiang, 99 pace. Um, then we went into the weekend league, got elite one. Those elite rewards turned into us completing a team of the knockout stage squad builder for a tradable player. And this player, I can't make this stuff up. You guys can look right there, 133,000 coins. You saw me turn the players from the packs. So all the, everything happened. The stuff I talked about in the beginning of this, I couldn't make it up. I told you I wanted one person. We get a walkout. Now see the Brazilian flag fall. And then I think to myself, oh my gosh, it's Casemiro. I wanted to get rid of 85 Casemiro for Modric or for a legend. But then we get 88 Casemiro. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, this is beautiful. It's exactly what we wanted. It's exactly what the doctor ordered, man. You can't make this stuff up. I did a, I did a, I did one of the, the squad builder challenges. We got Talishka. We turned that in and got Obamiang. Then we bought a card for 11 k Turned that in. Plus our rewards that we turned a few of those. One of those informs went into it as well. And we get Casemiro tradable. So, so we made about 60 to 70,000 coins right there. But I'm not going to sell them. I'm just going to throw them into the team. Give my man Moringo a contract. I'm going to throw a shadow on him. So I'm going to buy about 4,500 coins to pick up a shadow for the boy Casemiro. Because it will make him faster and better defense. And also we're going to make a move that I know a lot of you guys hear me say I love a player. And I did love Courtois at the time. I mean the man got me 38-2. and two. If he would have got you 38-2, and two, you probably would have been running around telling the whole world you loved him as well. He got me 38-2, and two, so I loved him. The following weekend, he didn't do so well, man. Unfortunately, he suffered a lot of dumb goals. So I'm going to bench Courtois for this weekend. And I'm going to go back to the boy, big boy, De Gea. Do I love this move? No. Do I like this move? No. But I ran with Butlin. I ran with freaking... 
Begovic, and we've come full circle back to De Gea. Courtois was amazing for me. Don't get it twisted. I still think he's one of the best ones in this game. Hands down, an absolute beast. But the goals he suffered last weekend, I'm just, I got to get away from him for a little bit. So we're going to throw De Gea back into the lineup. Look at that, man. Team is looking beautiful. It's almost the same as last weekend, but it's, it's all upgraded. Instead of Courtois at like an 89, we're going with a 90 De Gea. Instead of an 85 Casemiro, we're going with an 88 Casemiro, which now means if we don't ever sell this Casemiro, we could turn the 85 Casemiro into a squad builder challenge during team of the season if one does come out. And we're going to dive directly into Division 1 with our freaking upgraded team when we get matched up against the Casemiro. He has himself, also has himself a Buffon, also has himself a team in the knockout stage, Chiellini. Now, Booyah Nation going into this weekend league, as always, I'm just looking to hit elite. I don't care which elite, but I just want to hit an elite. With that being said, top 100 would be a dream. And with a team like this, I do think we should get top 100. If we don't get top 100, it's kind of a failure, but I never want to say it's a failure because getting top 100 is extremely difficult. So, as long as we get elite, if we don't get elite, at least elite one, in my opinion, it's an absolute failure. Now, with that said, being said, Booyah Nation, we've created our luck when it comes to constantly trying to play our best and win, 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 get Elite 1, get Elite 2, get Top 100. We created our luck there, but we did get extremely lucky. You know, Bamiang to walk out, then a Casemiro. Guys, I opened up about 13 or 14 of these packs on my main account. I didn't get one walkout. To turn around and come on this account, to get a Talishka, horrible the first one, but to use him to get a walkout Obamian, and then to use a blue for 11,000 to get a walkout Casemiro, I mean, it's just absolutely beautiful. It's something you just can't make up. So, absolutely wonderful. We got extremely lucky there. So, a little bit of luck, a little bit of us playing okay FIFA, and now we got ourselves a really stacked team and a really, really, really good account on FIFA, I would say. We have enough coins to buy loads of fitness cards. I ain't got to worry about that. And we're in good shape. We're in Division One, making people rage quit 3 0. Cope Aesthetic. Sonaldo, we still got him. Ronaldo, though we still got him um i really want that in I, I was looking to see if i would have sold brema not bought De Gea, if i could have somehow for uh, afforded striker anthony martial but that would only happen if I sold my Sonaldo, and I'm just not willing to sell my Sonaldo. So, an investment fave maybe going into next weekend will be picking up the big boy, Anthony Martial. This weekend is going to be lit, man. I really hope I could perform on this team. Now, this is kind of something that I'm saying to you guys kind of ahead of time, just to put in your head, just to kind of get you ready for next season. FIFA 18. If FIFA 18 stays anywhere the same as this, if you're going to do what I'm doing this year with a road of glory, I know we started late, so you, you didn't get to see how I would have started the account because we started this in January. What I would have what I would have done um, is simply started by the draft. I would have played maybe three or four drafts on this account. Okay, try I would have first try to get enough coins to enter the draft, then went into the draft and hopefully made a profit every time. Hopefully we would have actually banked on a little bit of luck. But the, you got to remember in the beginning of FIFA, hitting someone like an you know, Aubameyang is crazy money. Hitting someone like Ozil is crazy money. Hitting someone like Diego Costa. David Luiz, everyone is worth a lot of money in the beginning of FIFA, so the draft pays out heavy in the beginning. You can make loads of coins that way, get yourself a decent team, and get into foot champs and start getting elite finishes, and right from there, your account's already in a monstrous place. So keep that in mind going to next year. If FIFA does stay kind of the same, use the draft, abuse the draft. I'm going to do a road to glory next season. Um, hopefully, you know, if we're all still here doing our thing on YouTube, but well, hopefully, like, nothing ever goes bad and we can continue doing YouTube. I'm just saying, you know, like, hopefully we're here next year and you guys are still watching and we can... Um, uh, enter the FIFA 18 in a way that I'm not gonna have a main account. My Road to Glory is gonna be my main account. So yeah, man. With that being said, I know I know a lot of people look at this and be like, well, skills. The reason you have such a beast team so fast and you start in January is because you performed so well and you got top 100. I can't do that. You can do it. You can do it. I believe in you. You just gotta put your put your mind to it and really wanna get better. Remember that we got Elite, we, Elite One, I think it was, or Elite Two, the first ever weekend of, of the weekend of, of playing on this account with Sterling and Musa and stuff. And if I can do that, yeah, okay, I'm a, you know. You guys would be like, well, skills, you're a good player. I'm a decent player and stuff. If I can do it, you guys can do it. You just got to put your mind to it. Realistically, man, foot champs is the easiest way to make coins this game, this year. But you just got to find a way to muster up wins. And if you can't muster up wins, just try to get into the gold. Because even getting into the gold, even if you're frustrated, like, oh, I can't get past gold. I don't want to do this no more. Just getting gold every weekend will get you loads and loads and loads and loads of coins. So if you've given up on foot champs because you can't pass gold one, you probably should keep playing. Because even getting past gold one or even staying gold one is enough for you to build a mega team. Booyah Nation. I hope this video helped you in any way hope you enjoyed uh my elite uh war my elite one rewards and i hope you guys kind of you know got an insight on how to look at the fifa 18 i know we're really far away and i'll have way more videos on that later but it's just something to keep in mind man with that being said if you guys enjoyed please smash a big old thumbs up got a walk out got some decent elite packs i guess not really but hopefully you guys still enjoy but your boy skills foot champions good luck with it we out
I really feel like this dad hat makes me look like I'm 50 years old. Like as if I'm like, a, well, you know how they got like the, what they call the soccer moms, the football moms. I feel like I'm a football dad, like a football dad, you know, like a, like a soccer dad. Like I feel like I'm 50 years old about the coach, not even coach a game, probably just on the sideline acting like I'm going to coach a game. Like I'm smart enough, like the hat's making me look smart, but I don't. You, you know what I'm saying? What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Double A Nine Skills, and welcome back to a video that I thought we should do that could be a little bit fun today. So I noticed that, you know, EA dropped us a beautiful messy. Now, they did hit us kind of with a move. They finessed us, okay? Because from what I'm hearing, Booyah Nation, you can't get this messy in our rewards that we're getting today, and that's a little bit grimy. I'm not going to lie. Yo, EA, you hit us with a finesse move, and that's not cool. I'm not going to lie to you. I think it's awesome what you've done for us this year with Foot Champs, but yo, yo, don't be hitting us with a move like that. Now, let me know in the comments down below if you can confirm or deny whether we can get messy in our rewards. But either way, man, I hope you guys are having a terrific day, Booyah Nation. I hope you guys opened your rewards and hopefully hit some great stuff, man. If you are about to open your rewards or have already, good luck on them. With that being said, I decided, you know what? We haven't done something in a long time. And if you like the fact that we're doing this and you missed this on this channel, smash a big old thumbs up. Yo.